So one more subject I want to cover as part of this study is oversensitivity. Because as you progress on the spiritual life and you become open to the inner life, you can become oversensitive to everything outside of you. Whenever I come here, I appreciate this wonderful blessing to focus my attention within. But in this transition or this process, we can become very sensitive to what is outside of us, to other people, to their thoughts, to their emotions, to the suffering of the universe. We may feel the suffering around us as unbearable. And that sensitivity is a sign of our progress, but we must also figure out how to live with it. So Paul Brunton gives many exercises and advice about what we can do to protect ourselves from physical things we can do, such as a certain kind of bath to cleanse ourselves, to mental exercises that we can use to protect ourselves from negative influences. One example he gives is when you are in a negative environment to instantly imagine that you have a wall around you to protect you from the negativity. So once again, we can remember that when we have to do this, that we are not finished with our spiritual development because there is still an inner and an outer. As long as there is the appearance of an inner and outer, we must deal with it intelligently.